all the ulama they mention in the books of fiqh even in manhaj salikin the ulama in the books of fiqh including in manhaj salikin they mention the ruling of ar-ridda and ar-ridda is apostasy meaning a person who is a muslim and he does a certain action which is shirkun akbar or kufrun akbar and therefore leaves the fold of islam may allah protect us and these generally speaking there are four matters a particular statement for example if a person insults the religion insults allah in subhana insults the messenger sallallahu alaihi wasallam and then secondly certain actions like magic black magic sihr and then third certain beliefs like if a person believed that other than allah has knowledge of the unseen or that there will be a prophet after prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam and the fourth cause of apostasy ar-ridda is doubt meaning if a person doubts whether the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam is the final messenger or not or if a person doubts the the prophethood of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam and when it comes to the chapter of uh, ar-ridda apostasy the ulama they talk about the ruling of apostasy they don't talk about the punishment of apostasy as opposed to when it comes to for example the punishment of the thief they mention the punishment of the thief and the punishment of the sahir they mention the punishment of the sahir when it comes to the murtad the apostate they talk about the ruling of apostasy and this is because the murtad he is uh questioned by the hakim by the state by the sultan and he is told to repent and come back into islam as of, and and therefore no ruling or no punishment is applied to him as opposed to thief for example even if the thief was to repent the punishment still applies to him